Hey, how's it going guys? Tyler and Sam here from Team Cough. And today we're gonna to be doing some fishing here in the pond behind us. With the springtime coming around, you know, you guys have seen us doing ice fishing still, hitting the rivers, doing some belly boat fishing on the lakes that are starting to open up. And one thing we kind of forgot about is the pond fishing. So that's what we wanted to bring to you guys today. I know that some people that are much younger subscribers, they like this type of fishing. I know that some people, this is their favorite type of fishing. And if you're a really young angler, then this might be one of your only few options to hit is pond fishing. Obviously when it comes to pond fishing, it's different every pond, you know, it depends on the state you're in. There's bass in some ponds, there's panfish, there's trout, there's all kinds of different varieties of stuff. In the pond behind us today, there's largemouth bass, there's different types of panfish, crappie, um, and there's rainbow trout, a whole bunch of stocked rainbow trout. So today, just in order to spice things up a little bit, we're gonna be seeing how many fish me and Sam can catch in an hour using just lures. Okay, no worms, no soft baits, nothing like that. And the lure specifically that we're gonna be using is gonna be the Dynamic Lures HD Trout. We're gonna be using the HD Natural Trout pattern, but wish us luck, guys. We're gonna see how many fish we can get in this next hour. So guys, we're gonna be fishing for an hour. It's 3.18 right now. We're gonna get started with throwing some of these HD Naturals. See how, what we can do. We'll be checking in throughout. Here's the lure, HD Natural Trout pattern from Dynamic Lures. This is just a great lure, guys. Us at Team Cop, we use this stuff a lot when it comes to fishing for trout. Weather conditions today are pretty, pretty nasty, pretty crummy. Um, it's lightly raining on us, so if we get some drizzles on while we're catching fish, forgive me for that. You know, when it comes to this kind of crummy, nasty weather, it can be a really great time to get some fish. So hopefully we don't get rained out in this next hour, but we're gonna stick it out definitely as long as we can. I think we're gonna be fine, though. So the great thing about this bait, guys, is, oh! Oh, I already got a hit. Well, guys, the great thing about this lure is you can be used as just a little mini crank, or you can use it to do some jerk fishing too. And in the rivers, you can just kind of use the currents and just kind of do some drift fishing there. Got one. Nice, babe. All right, you guys, there's one. Got one in, and it is 322, so it's only been a few minutes since we first started the challenge. All right, little bows, guys. Let's get it back in. There he goes. Got one. Cam's on. I had something. Oh, she's not on. <laughs> Going. Oh, is that a crappie? Yeah, I got a crappie, guys. Nice, you guys. A little crappie action. A little black crappie. First crappie of 2020. All right, well, that's two fish, guys. Let's get it back in. I was super slow reeling in like the slightest little jerks. Got a trout, guys. Third fish of the day, babe. Number three. HD natural, he crushed it on the jerk. Nice. Less than 20 minutes in, guys. This is just, this lure just puts in work. More little stalker bows, really pretty though. Let's get him back in. There he goes. Got one. All right, guys, so it's been working. It's just super slow retrieve, super slow cranks, guys. Super slow twitches, so. Nice stuff, a little mix between cranking and twitch fishing. There it goes. All right, guys, so it's 3.49. We're just walking up to the front, trying to like at a different spot. We've got about 30 minutes left. It is pouring now. And let me remind you, it's low 40s, high 30s today, so it's freezing rain, but luckily we only got about 30 more minutes. So we got four fish so far. Hoping to at least get a couple more here before the time runs out. Sam's had some bites too. So unfortunately hasn't been able to connect on them. I've missed a couple myself. If you're looking for a good lure, guys, definitely check these lures out. I'm not sponsored by them or anything. It's just 
a really good lure and if you're watching this just want to give you a big tip to help you catch more fish oh i had a good bite i might have had something foul hooked oh, i got it Oh, that was sweet. I think he came back for it. Oh, he's gone. Well, you guys saw it. <laughs> oh, shoot. Just had a huge hit. I'm back in the first spot with the last 15 minutes left of this challenge. I had the best luck over here with two bites, a little bit more to my right, but I'm gonna try to, I'm trying to get a fish going oh I had one I had one again god third one so frustrating oh my god <laughs> did you see that one jump they're taunting me babes oh are you kidding me I hate you. <laughs> Got it right there on the jerk. Really pretty rainbow. There he goes. All right, you guys, we got three minutes left. Let's see if we can get one more fish. Oh. Yes. Nice. Get this pretty little bow back in the water, guys. Whoosh. Swim. Last clutch catch there. That was awesome. <laughs> see you guys at the car. All right, guys. We're back at the car. As you can see, we're kind of sitting inside it, being sheltered by the back part of it here. It's pouring rain really hard. Um, I don't know if you can <laughs> see on our coats or anything either, but we're we're pretty drenched. Fingertips pretty freezing, but. You know, it was a really fun hour of fishing. It really showed what the HD Natural Trout can do. I know Sam didn't land any, but she had a couple of fish on her line, had some really good bites. I missed a bunch of bites too, but I think that was nine, 10 fish total. I'll leave the total up here on the screen. We kind of lost count. But again, I hope you guys enjoyed the spring fishing. Hope you enjoyed the variety that we're bringing you. Uh, we're not gonna do a whole lot of pond fishing on this stuff. I know that's not a really popular video, but we want to make sure we're bringing everything that we can for you guys. And that definitely includes the pond fishing. So we got more ice fishing still to come. We got more river fishing, of course. We got more open bodies of water opening up here at the lower elevations. So we're gonna be belly boating those, hitting that from the bank. And then when the higher elevation stuff starts melting, then we're gonna be hitting that stuff too. And then hopefully here in a couple months yeah. or less, we'll start doing some camping too. Yeah. <laughs> but hope you guys enjoyed. Until next time, Team Cough signing out. Bye.